Welcome to the Movie Facts Show. I am your host, The Cinema Man, where I talk about movie facts that you might not know about your favorite films. Coming at you live from Indian Trail. So, let's get started with our first fact. Howdy there, everyone. Welcome back to the show. It's so great to see you. Today we're going to talk about my favorite animated film of all time, Rango 2011. So the film before the film was being described as a motion capture as the actors shot their scenes in live action for the animators to use for reference. Johnny Depp had 20 days in which to voice Rango and the filmmakers scheduled the supporting actors to interact with him. For Ben Skiggy, said his attempt on Rango was to do a small film after the free scale, three large scale Pirates of the Caribbean movies. Paramount stepped in at the last possible minute. As for Vincinski, slim financing was about to run out. The film's soundtrack was done by Hans Zimmer. That man is a legend compared to John Williams. The movie explores themes of self-discovery and identity. The art style for Rango was influenced by the works of the American painter Edward Hopper. The main villain, Rattlesnake Jake, was voiced by Bill Nighy. And here's a little known fact that the viewers might not know. Johnny Depp and Bill Nighy were the hero and the villain known as Jack Sparrow and Davy Jones. In the Pirates of the Caribbean trilogy. The movie's script was heavily influenced by classic Western literature. The film showcases the importance of friendship. The film tackles complex themes in an accessible way. One final note before we end today's episode the film won the Best Anime Feature for the 2012 Academy Award. And that was the first time that Disney. They had any films to compete with. <laughs> well, they did have Cars 2 in the same year. But, of course, we all know how that turned out. And they also had Winnie the Pooh the same year. But I think Winnie the Pooh got snubbed at the Oscars. So at the Oscars, Rango was going up against... Kung Fu Panda 2, Puss in Boots, The Adventures of Tintin. So, Rango 1, which I'm glad, because that was a really good film. Well, that wraps up today's episode. I'll be back very soon with more episodes. So until then, this is the Cinema Man signing off. Good night, everybody.